Meteor Shield? Nah, he has sleeves. Meteor Shield. Meteor Shield is wearing a sleeveless shirt today. Yo, Yami, you... the match is starting. You can't. You gotta get the ponytail up before the match starts. I understand that it's like annoying. It, it is annoying. It's, 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 I don't know. I find it annoying to make sure that a uh, stray hair doesn't escape the confines and just fall directly in, in front of your eyes when I put my hair up, but you can't be doing a round start. Yeah, I figure that situation out before the round starts. <laughs> oh no. I have the hiccups now. This is horrible. This is terrible. I blame you, chat. I don't have a sudden craving for hot chocolate, but I should probably talk about the match instead of my sudden craving. I want hot chocolate so bad. I want to get hot chocolate the next time I go grocery shopping. It's settled. It's decided. What? Oh, that was about was hatch round. Okay. Whew. I think we could have a very good match on our hands here. A very back and forth close match on our hands. Um. I know that the theory is that Slayer is neutral is bad. I don't think I agree with that theory. I think his neutral is just okay. Um, but it's okay. Just barely managing to save her rage gauge. Shifting back almost into a full bar here. And we're seeing the, the comeback potential that you have when you have good fundamentals and you play Abba. Abba is a very high comeback potential character. Slayer is as well. You know... Slayer, you know, does a lot of damage, so Slayer can come back with a, a hard knockdown in a dream uh, pretty easily. Uh, Abba can come back with a, you know, a, a rage gauge in a dream. Right. Nothing but the ten dollars in her in her pocket, a rage gauge, and a dream, and she, you know, made something of herself and became the CEO of whatever corporation. And that's why she shouldn't have to pay taxes. <laughs> That's why she shouldn't have to contribute to society. You're taking time for the mental. Taking time for the mental is important, okay? Especially if your mental needs stabilized. Like, take your time, you know? You are entitled to it, at least to an extent. Don't, don't be taking, like, a minute between each round. That's a little... That's a little absurd. But, you know. And Yama, once again, basically immediately into Jealous Rage, who just barely like gets the last pixel there to shift out of it, so she doesn't empty out. Are we going to see the neutral Jealous Rage shift? No, we're not. That's, you can kind of tell. Nope, she's blocking. She stays blocking, and this punish is good. Okay, then. Pretty sure that's punishable. Probably could have comboed to death, but fuck it. I understand. Given that Yemma may very well be as experienced in, with ABBA as I am like in Street Fighter at all, and that I frequently punish with uh, throws, I get it. I feel you. Ouch, I'll fuck my bones, and there goes about a third of, of Yemma's uh, health bar off of like two hits. But now she's got a full bar to work with. See, this is what I mean, like, the back dash worked. And then Zeal still had to hold that ship. That's not going to hit. Gets blocked. She does have time. Potentially that was a safe jump, to be fair. Uh, that's quite a bit of chip damage. She's going to have to shift out of Rage Gauge here, which does give Zeal a light at the end of the tunnel. Abba is going to be slower than Slayer is now. And with that Slayer, I mean, she's on a fucking slower now. She's, she's on a fucking slower now. You know what it is. With the R into the key grab, she's still gonna need not to eat something on Zeal's wake up, which is exactly what happened. I expected a reversal, not a throw, uh, but I also expected what she did to Meaty, which I think she may have expected that as well, uh, but for some reason it did not happen. Fucking Looney Tunes ass throw. That one might have hit. She's been struggling with that that specific follow up. The the like half moon sort of air to ground slash into J 
jump cancel into another one. She's been struggling with that one, but I think that one legitimately would have hit if it weren't for the YRC. So she's getting better at that. Uh, and you love to see people improving. Life is all about whatever you want it to be all about, but I think it's all about improvement, me personally. And that is going to be 2-0 in Yemma's favor. Both players look like they're going to the drawing board. Yemma probably trying to keep herself calm, keep the nerves from allowing uh, Zeal to snatch a victory from the jaws of defeat here. And Zeal probably just going back to the chalkboard. <laughs> Redrawing the plays, rewriting the playbook, trying to figure out how to turn this shit around. Uh, which is valid. You can see Yama steadying the nerves. It's been effective. It's been very effective for her. Uh, in the time that we, we've seen this technique, this breathing technique, be employed by Yama, she's consistently gone very far in bracket and is now one game. I'm going to knock on wood so I don't commentators curse because I hate commentators cursing people. Uh, one game away from potentially going to grand finals uh, here. Which it wasn't unheard of for her before, certainly. But I, I, I feel she's playing with a, a greater, a more consistent level of performance. If that makes sense. Ooh, drops the the close slash of the uh, combo there on the bat stop. Probably lost a good bit of damage there. Definitely a lot of screen position off of that. And now Yemma is in Jealous Rage with a full bar. Let's see what the... And all of that, all of that shit that you just saw without Jealous Rage. Proving that the, the Abba is capable of cooking even when she's not angry. In fairness, I always find it easier to cook when I'm not angry. You ever try to saute something when you're pissed off? It doesn't work. Cooking is a delicate art. All right. it's, it, also, cooking when you're tired sucks. Because uh, I'll be honest, when I'm tired, I just kind of want to like put some shit in a pot of broth and boil it till it's food. Yeah, you know, when I'm like exhausted. <laughs> I don't know why I'm talking about this now. That doesn't taste good. 